Uh, today we're reviewing the Coglin's Camper S'mores Grill. Now this is a little bit different than uh, your normal way of doing s'mores with, you know, uh, getting the marshmallows hot and then sticking it on a uh, sandwich of uh, graham crackers and Hershey's bars. What The way this works is that everything's all sandwiched together and um, that way it all kind of cooks up as one uh, entity. So we're going to try it. Uh, our campfire here is just, we're getting down to where we're getting some coal. So we're going to assemble a couple s'mores and see how it works. Well there we go. We got the uh, s'mores made into the uh, little basket here. And there's definitely a trick to doing this. Uh, we dropped a couple of graham crackers on the ground trying to do it. So uh, best thing to do is do it on a table. And uh, once you get them in, we're just going to set this over the fire here for a little bit and uh, see what happens. Well, even put them over the coals. Um, it's a little bit difficult to get, a, get all three of them to the same consistency. We got nice toasting on the first two here, but the last one is a little more difficult. So. Um, you may want to experiment with just one or two, but you may also want to adjust the coals in your fire because if you got f too much flame, it tends to want to burn these. But first couple look pretty good, so we'll, we're going to let them cool down a little bit. Okay, we've taken them out, and it does leave oh a little bit of mess. There's a little bit of chocolate dripping and stuff, so you know it's nothing that can't be cleaned up. And uh, here's the final result. Uh, Lightly toasted, um, the chocolate started melting a little bit, and we're going to let this set for a few seconds or a few minutes until the chocolate quits running. I think then it would be just about perfect. So, uh, a little bit of finessing to do this, uh, it takes a little bit of practice uh, to get the things loaded, but uh, hey, you know, it makes a pretty good looking s'more, I think.